I want to talk about something called the right hand rule. So when you're dealing with 3D points in space, X, Y, Z points, and you're dealing with rotating objects, you need a way to identify each axis and the direction that is positive rotation of each axis. So for instance, we have the red axis here is X, the green axis is Y, and the blue axis is Z. Our arrow points to the positive direction, in this case of Y, and if I grab this and pull this, you'll see Y gets larger. Okay, so that's why it's positive direction. It increases that value. Showcase uses something called the right hand rule, and most 3D programs use this method. And what the right hand rule states is if you put your thumb and you point it in the positive direction of X, and you point your first finger in the positive direction of Y, and you point your middle finger in the positive direction of Z, no matter how you rotate your hand, the X, Y, Z axes will always face the right way. And if you point your thumb in the positive direction of any of the axes, in this case the Y axis, the way your fingers curl is positive rotation. So let's give this right hand rule a try inside a showcase rotating an object. Let's say I want to rotate this ball around. You can see um, the hole was at this end, and it actually should be at this end down here. Uh, so let me just isolate that so you can see it. So you, you can see uh, it should be spun around 180 degrees. So what I want to do is highlight this. I'm going to go to a front view. And I want to figure out which axis to rotate this on. And if I use my right hand rule and place my thumb in positive direction of X, my first finger in the positive direction of Y, which is kind of hard to do right now, and we'll skip that. And I'll do my middle finger in the positive direction of Z. Um, and then you can see I need to rotate this on the Y axis. And Showcase makes this pretty easy because it's got a green uh, rotational arrow there. So the green is, uh, again, RGB. Green is the Y axis, so I'm rotating on the Y axis. So normally with the right hand rule, once you find the axis that you're rotating on, if you point your thumb in the positive direction of the axis that you're rotating, in this case Y, the way your fingers curl is positive rotation. Uh, so I had to do the reverse because I couldn't get my, uh, take the picture and have my hand facing the correct way. So I actually am pointing in the negative Y direction. So my angle is reversed here. Now in this case it's 180 degrees so it doesn't matter if it's positive or negative uh, but if I wanted to go 90 degrees it would rotate one way or another and that would matter so I'm just gonna uh, click on this and type in there 180. And you can see that spun it around in the correct orientation. So I hope that helps you out as you work with uh, the Autodesk 3D products. Uh, it's going to work the same way in 3ds Max, Showcase, Maya, Mudbox, Revit, AutoCAD, and a whole slew of others. Thanks for watching. See you next time.